In Eugene, the third annual Black Cultural Festival will be kicking off this Saturday with a focus on unifying and uplifting the community. It starts at 11 a.m. at Alton Baker Park, which is an important place in the history of Eugene's African-American community. Here's Tiffany Lewis with the story. Black pride, joy, and excellence. That's the goal of this weekend's Black Cultural Festival in Eugene. This year's theme, Lifting as We Rise, represents a strong Black community that prioritizes uplifting each other with outreach and support. A space for belonging, healing, and inclusion, the Black Cultural Festival highlights culture through art, entertainment, speakers, and food. We spoke to the festival's founder about the importance of this event. Historically, Oregon is an overwhelmingly white state, leading to a lack of community for its black residents. It's really important that all cultural groups, that all people feel a sense of belonging and safe space wherever they live. Um, we noticed that here in the Eugene Springfield area, because black people don't have a place in space until now or until recently, um, they come here, they check it out they realize it's not for them and then they leave, right? So the Black Cultural Festival is that place and space for us to gather together to celebrate our culture and our community and to have a really good time. Saturday's festival will be held at Alton Baker Park, a place of historical significance for African-American families. When Eugene, you know, back in the day was actually a sundown town and essentially those families could work in Eugene, but they couldn't actually live in Eugene. So come sundown, they actually needed to leave the city limits. Where they resided was in Alton Baker Park. And that's where they were allowed, that's where they created home and a place of, and space. That place and space was the Ferry Street Village, one of the first black neighborhoods in Lane County. In 1949, after numerous warnings, a bulldozer demolished all the homes in the area and a church to build the Ferry Street Bridge. Two years ago, the Lane County Board of Commissioners passed a resolution acknowledging the county's role in the neighborhood's destruction. Now, Eugene's NAACP branch and City of Eugene government are working to create a memorial that will be placed in Alton Baker Park, where that neighborhood once stood and where Saturday's festival will happen. Having a, an entire festival that's dedicated to black voices and black art vendors and just building that community is always really great and beneficial. It's just basically putting more of a spotlight on black artists and black people in general in the city of Eugene because historically we never had that spotlight on us and I'm just trying to help contribute so that we can get more awareness uh, in the community of the talents, the business um, and just people in general that's out here and trying to thrive as well as the other people that we live amongst. The festival welcomes all persons of Afro descent, close friends and family and community allies. In Eugene, I'm Tiffany Lewis. Adult tickets are a $15 donation. Youth and seniors get in for free. Singers, poets, and speakers will perform at the main stage from 10 a.m. until 6.15 p.m. Solid Strides will be hosting a horse and pony petting zoo in the youth zone from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. You can find a link to the Black Cultural Festival's program and volunteer information on our website.